sister's on an airplane the other day, and she was playing this game of satisfaction. And she was in a first-class cabin, so it was easy, nice wide seat. <laughs> she was feeling pretty good, and she was comfortable in her seat. And she has a neck pillow that she really likes. It positions her head just right, and, and it's really comfortable. And she has a way of positioning her body in the seat and her legs out in front of her. So she had found true comfort, and she was acknowledging, I am so satisfied. And then she thought, oh, wait, there's the slightest little chill in the air. So she reached for the blanket that Delta had provided and took it out of its wrapper and put it up over her body and settled in. And she thought, oh, I am so satisfied. And then she thought, if I put my sunglasses on, I'll be even more comfortable. So she put her sunglasses on and she settled into her seat for her long winter's nap. <laughs> and as she's sitting there, she's thinking, I'm so satisfied. And then the flight attendant tapped her on the shoulder and handed her a hot bottle of water. He had taken a water bottle and put it in the microwave and heated it up. And he said to her, this might make you more comfortable. And Esther said, thank you. And as he walked away, she thought, I wonder if I look old and feeble. <laughs> and then she thought, no. No. He's caught up in the momentum of my satisfaction. It's like the universe is looking around. Is there anyone in my vicinity that could add to my satisfaction in any possible way? And so the most random thing happened. How many millions of miles has Esther flown? And never before has anyone had, even when she was cold and really could have used a hot <laughs> bottle, it's the universe is looking to enhance what you've got going on, you see. And so when you get going on this satisfaction, when you start looking for evidence of your own satisfaction and finding it, oh, you are going to be knocked over by how many cooperative components add to that satisfaction. And of course, the opposite is true too, isn't it?